Alright, I'll try to do a quick little video of my night vision scope. As you can see, I can see a little bit more than what you can see here, but not much. So let's see how this, there we go. I know it don't look real good. Trying to hold the little camera lens up against the night vision. But that is pretty cool. Now your field of vision is kind of small. But at the same time, that's pretty awesome. It's amazing what what you can see and how clear it is. Um, I, I can't see it good enough to focus. This is a four power scope, so you're supposed to, you gotta focus it as you change uh, distances. So some of this may be blurry, and if it is, I'm sorry. I, I just can't see it good enough to focus it in. Um, And I gotta hold this button down. I keep letting go of to do the hour uh, infrared illumination. I know it ain't probably nowhere near like a fifteen hundred dollar scope, but for a hundred and thirty five dollars. I think it come out pretty good. As you can see, the closer stuff is, it really reflects that light back and it's a lot brighter. Uh, the further away, it's a lot dimmer. In real, in, you know, if you was actually looking through the scope, you can see a lot better than what this is showing up. This is, not a good representation of night vision I know and I apologize for that but just to give you an idea that for 150 bucks you can get some entry level uh, night vision would be a big advantage if uh, you ever had to, you know, shit hit the fan, you guard in your house at night. Hey, I, yeah, it's not thermal and it's not generation three, but it's better than nothing. So, better than, than that. Because <laughs> that's what you'd normally be looking at. So, that's pretty good. Anyway, a little, uh, I don't know, where'd it go? A little, uh, update on my little night vision. You know, hopefully, uh, I know it's not a good video, but at least give you an idea that this crap does work. Anyway, that's it.